Hey guys, Mr. Backerberg here. In this video, we're going to look at matrix addition and subtraction. So let's say we had two different matrices. Let's say we had a matrix A and we had a matrix B. And let's say we wanted to add them together. Now we can only add or subtract matrices if they have the same order. And the way we do matrix addition or subtraction is that we just add or subtract the corresponding entries. So let me give these matrices some entries. Let's say matrix A has the entries 2, 7, negative 4, and 3. And we're going to add on matrix B. And it has to be the same order. So let's say that it's negative 1, 5, 9, and 0. So we're adding these two together. And we're going to be getting a new matrix as our answer. And because we're adding, we're just going to add up the corresponding entries. So 2 plus negative 1 would give me 1. 7 plus 5 would give me 12. Negative 4 plus 9 would give me 5, and 3 plus 0 would give me 3. So we get a new matrix of the same order as our original two matrices with entries 1, 12, 5, and 3. So in this example, we're going to add these two matrices together. And the first thing we want to check is that they have the same order. So this first one has three rows and two columns. The second one has three rows and two columns. So yes, they have the same order. So then since we're adding, we're just going to add up the individual entries. So 7 plus negative 9 is negative 2. 9 plus 8 is 17. Negative 4 plus positive 4 is 0. 0 plus negative 9 is negative 9, and negative 2 plus 3 is 1, and 3 plus 2 is 5. So this is our new matrix from adding those original two matrices together. Now in this example, we're going to do a little subtraction. Notice that these are the exact same matrices from before, but now we're subtracting them. We do have to be a little extra careful when we're subtracting. Subtraction always seems to get a little trickier for some people, so let's just make sure that we slow down and take our time as we're going through this. So we already know that we can do this subtraction because we checked the orders previously when we were adding them. So we're just going to do the subtraction. So 7 minus negative 9, double negative turns positive. So this is going to be 16. 9 minus 8 is 1. Negative 4 minus 4 is going to be negative 8. 0 minus negative 9 is going to be positive 9. Negative 2 minus 3 is going to be negative 5. And 3 minus 2 is going to be 1. So this is our new matrix from subtracting those two original matrices. That's going to be it for this video. Thanks for watching.